LMPD is revealing tonight its plans to fire the police officer who hit a kneeling protester with a riot stick during demonstrations last May. Hello, everybody, and thanks for joining us. All new on the WHS 1119 team, is this a sign of more accountability on the part of the police department? The night team's Tyler Memory has more on the officer and reaction from those who marched for days in Louisville. On the last day of May last year, the protests over Breonna Taylor's death drew large crowds. On that day, LMPD officer Corey Evans allegedly hit a protester in the back of the head with a riot stick while the protester was kneeling with their hands in the air, surrendering to arrest. Now, LMPD has moved to fire Evans. I wouldn't say that it's like a super, super huge win, but it's a significant win. According to federal documents, the victim had injuries after Evans hit him. The officer is being charged with deprivation of rights under color of law. I, I want to believe um, that this is the beginning of a step towards reform of this police department, which is badly needed and has been needed for years. Protest leaders like Chris Will and attorney David Maurer, who also marched daily, say it's a step in the right direction. We, we just want officers to be held accountable. Is That's it. LMPD says Evans had been placed on administrative reassignment as they halted their internal investigation while the federal one is ongoing. In a statement, they wrote, the chief's office immediately referred these allegations to federal authorities when they came to light. The federal investigations resulted in Evans' indictment. Why are our local officials not doing anything about this? Both Maurer and Will question why it took the DOJ's involvement in Louisville to bring a charge against an officer for actions during last summer's protests. I can't believe they've come to town to look at the events that have happened over the last year and they're going to charge one cop. It wouldn't be... Um, a far stretch to say, <laughs> buckle up. Not only hoping, but say they also believe more indictments will come to other officers. Officer Evans most recently served in LMPD's first division. His attorney declined to comment on the case at this time, but online court records show that Evans is expected to plead guilty to the charges in court on July 14th. For the night team, I'm Tyler Emery.